shocking, ridiculous, suspicious, and fun. Welcome to the Perfect Liars Club. You'll hear four stories, three of them true. But one of the suspects is lying to you. Question and point the finger, laugh out loud. If you catch the liar, you can brag and be proud. L-I-A-R. Perfect Liars Club. Liar. Perfect Liars Club. What do you think it is? I think that Bobby is the liar. Why do you think so? Because I think that the story may be partially true, but I think that the SWAT team took it to another level. Like I, I don't think that I don't think there was actual SWAT team. Maybe a police officer, but not a whole SWAT team. I think it's Moana because uh, she said that this guy was coming from the balcony and then suddenly he appeared at her door. So how did that happen? I, I don't see how that can really happen. It's Taylor. Taylor. Any reason why? Because uh, when I was a girl, first of all, years and years ago, I got caught smoking and there's no way I'd make it through a whole pack of cigarettes. One, too. and I was dying yeah. halfway through. Sick, coughing, dizzy, no way. And you always know, I mean, if your parents really smoked, you would know and you would mention the kind of cigarettes they smoked. Mm -hmm. You would never forget. I mean, my dad smoked Marble Light 100s. I'll never forget that until the day I die. Blazoned in your brain. 100% Bobby. Undetermined amount of number of people. Um, undetermined de like distance to locations. Um, just feels very scripted to me. Just feels like a little bit too like Hollywood. Um, who goes to a beach to eat ice cream cake? I mean, no, 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 no. These are high schoolers. They're acting cool. Who thinks it's cool to go to a, a, a beach to eat ice cream cake? If it's nighttime, doesn't matter if it's like Florida and sunny and hot. I mean, who would have a picnic sheet? What is wrong with ice cream cake? No, this is not about ice cream cake. I love ice cream cake. We're the perfect liar of January 2019. Please step forward. My eighth now uh, that I've gone wrong in a row. So I'm not very good at this. But uh, I must say that losing has never been more fun. I think, um, I think we learn to deal with it. Hmm? Yeah, it's it's humbling. By being wrong is. <laughs> I'm wrong a lot of the time. I'm like I'm gonna take this and go home now and go. I'm probably right about as often as I'm right on perfect liars. Like, I'm probably wrong, like, 100% of the time about everything. You just have to kind of laugh. Welcome to the perfect liars club. You'll hear four stories, three of them true. But one of them...